welcome back to Alan Wake. Um, like, um, sorry it's been a while since the last part. I've been kind of um, playing The Division since it's been released and I just kind of got basically as far as I could with that and so ready for the DLC because they said they're going to be released at the same time. So I want to just get ahead. And memories. Right, here we go. Hey, what are you up to? I hey guys, I'm so sorry for the uh, low microphone volume. Um, I didn't realize that something messed with my microphone, and also I did not I did not run <coughs> the other program, which will allow me to change the microphone so volume separately from enemies. the uh, game volume. So I couldn't do anything about that. So my bad. You, I still hope you guys enjoy it anyway. So I forgot to, that I could just use a flare on that guy. Problem solved. Why am I hearing an alarm clock over there? I'm even pressing F to use the ladder because F in um, the division is to use stuff. What was that ticking I heard? There was something back here. Eh, alarm clock. <laughs> Get need some batteries on that. Definitely need one of those though. Oh, nice is a bit fast. Oh, that's never a good sound, is it? No. No, it isn't. Thanks for your inside the bar. Whoops. Oh god, I'm gonna have to pick this up every time I die. Oh, flare. Oh, that's never a good sound, is it? No. No, it isn't. That's not for that, though. I'm just gonna activate him and then quickly run back. So I want more room to be able to move. I can't give them both barrels at the same time. That'd be great. <coughs> Red box. I love how the word thing is pretty unique to me. It's like, I don't see other games that do things like that. Or similar. I'm looking forward to wrapping this uh, new game uh, called. Uh, Quantum Zone, which I forgot already, shit. I'll leave a link in the description for that. Guess, like, one of the on that I'm not quite sure. Maybe I should use a different gun there.
they're not even really there. Well, my allergies are definitely here. Hushie! See? Allergies. Also, there's one thing that um, hit me while I was playing last time. I didn't mention it at the time, but it's like, Harry Allen doesn't question if um, Tom might be real there you know, or not. Like, part of all this madness, or just actually the. just doesn't question that. He just kind of falls where he's supposed to be going blindly without asking questions. So I'd be questioning that possibility myself, like if this guy is real or not. Downstairs. We don't have time for Alan. I knew she wasn't really here, but she still made my heart ache. I had saved Alice, but I wasn't even sure when that happened. Was it days ago? Weeks? Longer? I had no way of knowing. How do I? Whoa, that's fast. I guess you gotta run out. Yes, thank you. I don't know how I'm supposed to get up. I guess I need to activate it again. Uh, and I fell for it. Awesome. I'm pretty sure I clipped through that after I watched that back and find it for myself. Hey, lover. Come here. I've got something for you. I could only hope that Alice was all right. I didn't know what happened to her after she left the dark place. Zane? Is that you? Oh, shit. <gasps> hey, hold that pose. That was a good one. Like this? Yeah, but smile a little more. No, that's too much. You want to look mysterious, maybe a little tough. You know how people go for those dangerous bad boys. But I'm not dangerous. Oh, come on. You write about terrible things all the time. People want to think that you're intimately familiar with them. You kill Casey in this book. You need to look a little bit like a murderer. Oh, that's good. Do that again. You look handsome. And dangerous. You know, I wasn't sure about the beard before, but I was wrong. It looks good on you. Okay, I think we're done. Great. I want to get out of this suit. Hey, things are looking up. <laughs> Guess danger is sexy. <laughs> that was when I was still working. 
when I felt like a real writer instead of a fraud. It was a good memory. I wished I hadn't seen it. And you can see he wasn't wearing a suit there. Okay, it's getting kind of weird. What's the clock in this room? Yeah, the clock there. What am I supposed to be looking for in here? Alan, you made it. This area of the dark place is calmer, at least for the time being. We can talk here, but we don't have much time. Zane, how do I get out of here? That's what you face. That's you, even as we speak. Darkness. Darkness coming! Swept him away. Lost! He knew. He knew! He couldn't hold on. He knew there was no way out. Oh. No! I'm right here, oh, Zane! What's going wrong? That's not me, it's just... Oh. I don't know, an echo, a hallucination, the dark presence. No. The Dark Presence is not responsible for this. You are making this happen. You're trapped in your own nightmares. You are fighting yourself. Wayne didn't understand it. He would never make it. He would never wake up. He'd get swallowed up in the rising tide of darkness. It was coming. It was coming. Shut up! Gah! No! Alan, you must be. Swept away by the gathering insanity. Zane was gone. Wake could feel the pressure, gnawing at his mind. The darkness wasn't so bad. It was in him. He felt it. He knew the voice spoke the truth. It was just too hard to think. He can't, couldn't make sense of it. He wanted to go with the flow. Stop thinking and just let go. something It's getting kind of ridiculous.
doesn't really need to be more of this, really. Oh, okay, that's different. definitely didn't play any of this before, so these parts are new to me. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you in the next one. There's one thing I will say though, the, uh, the TV thing got a bit much, I think. That they could have uh, done something a little different, but well. I still enjoyed the extra. I, I wouldn't call it an episode more of uh, just a level. That's it. But there's one more to go, which I will do, and I'll do it next time. And I'll leave the description for the other game that I was talking about as well. I'll leave the link for that in the description, so I was meant to say. Anyway, see you in the next one.